I started working as a journalist um, about nine years ago and uh, I immediately signed up to be in the White House press list so I would receive um, constant updates of the White House of whatever was happening so I can have other stories to tell besides uh, stories about entertainment. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, I got the opportunity to cover his visit to ICE in Nashville when he came to Nashville. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and I get invitations all the time for all the different events that the White House hosts. Mm -hmm. I just don't feel, didn't feel like I should go because, you know, we have to travel to DC or whatever mm -hmm. he is. But this time, I received that email with the invitation to go to Cuba, and I was like, oh my God, and I didn't know what to do, so I emailed a friend of mine, and she said, you got to do it, you got to do it, you got to do it, so she helped me put it all together, and um, her husband used to be a journalist for, the C for CNN, <laughs> and he's semi-retired, and I asked him, can you go with me, so he went, and, and the trip was amazing, unforgettable, emotional, extraordinary. I need more words to, to explain how it felt because as Cuban, to be able to go to my country with President Obama, it was like out of the world, you know, out of the ordinary. And for my family, it, I don't even know how they felt mm -hmm. because my mom was just looking at me and not saying anything. Now, was this your first time back to Cuba since when? Uh, since two years ago. Uh, I so went you, two years uh -huh, ago, yeah. Uh -huh. How many times have you been back to Cuba since you first left? Oh, my God. Um, so it's a regular maybe, kind of thing with you. Maybe four or five times, mm -hmm, yeah. Mm -hmm, because, mm -hmm. you know, my family is still there. My mm -hmm. mom, my brothers, my sister, mm -hmm, my mm -hmm. whole family. Now, now, in, in terms of this invitation that you received, uh, now, how did that work out? I mean, uh, what, what was the... Give us some information in reference to that. Well, uh, the thing is that all the media that are on the White House list are invited to come. <laughs> but you're responsible financially for the trip. They do everything, but at the end of the day, you have to pay for the expenses mm -hmm. of the trip. That's how it works. Now, how did Cuba look to you uh, th this time around? It looked uh, as uh, the same. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, they just fixed the roads mm -hmm. where they knew that President Obama was mm -hmm. going to travel through, or they painted the buildings and the um, the baseball game where it was hosted. Mm -hmm. The the stadium was painted like within a week, mm -hmm. and um, those things are just facade. You mm -hmm. know, it's not what the real thing is mm -hmm. is going on in Cuba. Mm -hmm. It's more than that. And so, in a real sense, this gave you an opportunity to see your family. Once yes. Uh, and and what we want to do during the second segment is to. Uh, show some images mm -hmm. and I want you to uh, uh, narrate some of the images that you will see and tell us about okay. that because this is this is really a wonderful trip for you was oh, it not yes. uh, to go back and to uh, find that uh, not only are you with the president but you, your family is still yes. there. Yes, yes it was amazing. Mm -hmm. Very good and, and so what we're going to do we're going to take our first commercial break and then we'll come back and we'll have the uh, images and uh, we'll have about eight minutes for those images and I want you to uh, narrate for us what we're seeing on the screen and then after that eight minute narration then we'll uh, have our final uh, break and then we'll come back for 10 minutes and to talk about uh, some of your impressions and some of the things that you saw that you think that our audience ought to know about and of course we'll be back with our audience following this very very short uh, commercial break. And so <clears throat> this is an eight minute segment. Okay. And what we want to do is to put the images up and to uh, have you to. Uh, uh, you a little okay. Bit. <laughs> and to uh, have you to narrate uh, those images. And okay. so we'll do that for eight minutes. And then we'll come back. We'll take another break and we'll come back and we'll give you 10 minutes to talk about uh, the wow. trip to Cuba and some of the things that you felt about it. Mm -hmm. and, the emotions that you had in reference mm -hmm. to, did, did you go to the baseball game as well? Yes. You went to the and yeah, I put a clip in there. Uh -huh. Yeah. Very well, good. That, that'll yeah. give you an opportunity to talk about, you know, some yeah. of the things yeah, that, yeah, yeah. Uh, this is a first-hand view yeah, I in have terms thought, of uh, yeah. President Obama's trip to Cuba. And we mm -hmm. think that... Uh, oh, I should have brought the credentials, I forgot. Uh, the what now? The credentials. I credentials the, you got the credentials that, that you the, used yeah. to... Oh, yeah, I good. forgot that, to bring yeah, it. That, that'll be fine, though. Yeah. 
But I think this will be, this will testify that you were there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Okay, and so this will be our uh, eight minute segment. Now, we're going to do the images now, is that right? The what? The images. Uh, yeah, they got them there. I'm going to be going there tomorrow. Oh, okay, very mm -hmm. good. All right. Is it warm outside? Is it still warm outside? It's it really raining? beautiful. It's not no, raining. it's not raining. It's beautiful. Perfect. No, we've got eight minutes on this. Thank you and welcome back to the second segment of the show for today. We talked to Ms. Shayla Paz, and she's given us some information in reference to the uh, trip that uh, President Obama took to Cuba 